Early morning at the Supreme Court of Kenya, the new DCA boss Amin Ibrahim Muhammad being sworn into office. Do you swear that I will be faithful? Amin took two oaths, oath of allegiance to the constitution. And the president of Kenya during my service in the Directorate of Criminal Investigations. And allegiance of loyalty to the organization he serves. Malice or ill will that I will at all times do my utmost to preserve the peace. The ceremony was presided over by Chief Justice Mother Kome as a main pledge to serve the DCA with integrity and professionalism in order to reduce crime in the country. We shall tackle the contemporary challenges that we face as a country that include terrorism, narcotics, human trafficking, cybercrime, corruption, and money laundering to the extent that our mandate allows. Among things the new DCI boss has to address are allegations of how the criminal justice system was being used for political gains. I'm ready for the task. Already senior police officers at the directorate have sworn affidavits withdrawing their statements against some senior government officials who had pending court cases. There have also been huge accusations against the DCA on how it was involved in abductions and killing of Kenyans. Something the new DCI chief has promised the president to deal with days after the DCI special service unit was disbanded and all its officers sent on compulsory leave. Some of his officers have also been grilled over the abduction of two Indians and their driver who are in Kenya to help President Ruto's IT experts during the August polls. Ile ilikuwa inaitua special sijui nini ya police amba ilikuwa inaua wa Kenya kiholela. Acting Inspector General of Police Nurugabo has already effected some of the major changes moments after Amin Muhammad was sworn into office. The changes are as follows. John Gashomo, who was leading the investigations bureau, has been deployed as the new Director Internal Affairs Unit. Nicholas Kamwenda has been appointed as the Deputy Director DCI. Elid Lagat is the new Director Investigations Bureau and Johnson Cole appointed as ATPU Director. The team consists of experts and experienced detectives who will lead the directorate as the new office takes up its task. More changes are in the offing. Franklin Walla, K24 TV.